All right, have fun and do some good in the process. Sounds nice, right? More than a dozen local celeb chefs are heading to Woodland Park Zoo, and you have the chance to sample all of their star menus. All this while helping to save wildlife. Woodland Park Zoo set to host Wild Bites August 4th, and this morning, we got a sneak peek. Joining us live from the zoo, animal keeper Susie Semler. Susie, it is good to see you once again, and it sounds like we have a special guest also. Yes, good to see you. Good morning. I am coming here with uh, Harry, our striped skunk, who is also here to tell you all about Wild Bites. Good morning. Good morning, and good morning, Harry. All right, so tell us a little bit about Wild Bites. I have done this event before. It is super fun. Um, what can people expect when they head out? Right, it sounds like so much fun to me. So people can expect an after hours event at the zoo and it does feature 13 local chefs. They can walk around the zoo, they can sample tasty treats and even sip on some beer or some wine and nice. see all sorts of animals. We're even gonna have some of our ambassador animals there so you might get to see Harry skunk live in person along with other animals like reptiles or birds. You never know what ambassador animals are gonna make it out for the party yeah this is really fun and it's a great way to see the zoo sort of behind the scenes as well uh, Susie can you talk a little bit about how this helps benefit Woodland Park Zoo Definitely. Well, proceeds from the, this event and even just for general entry to Woodland Park Zoo, they go to help support the many conservation projects the zoo supports. There's over 30 of them, both locally and globally. So it helps the animals you see at the zoo and the animals in your backyard. And so you can feel good about coming to this special event. Like I said, it's adults only. There's food, there's drink. You're going to have a great time and you're definitely going to support wildlife. I love that. So I do need to ask, uh, I've seen a lot of toys that Harry he's playing with that are like dog toys. I'm seeing a Kong and you're feeding him treats. Uh, for the viewers at home, tell us a little bit about Harry. I, I mean, is he's a skunk. Is he stinky? Like, are you worried about that at all? <laughs> well, Harry is very comfortable with us. So yes, in general, skunks obviously can spray. They can be very stinky, but I can tell he's very relaxed. He's just excited to be here. And you got it. He's playing with all sorts of toys. It turns out that dog toys and baby toys also make Aww. great skunk toys. <laughs> so he's hanging out with his, um, I've got some meal worms hidden in Aww. this paper box for him. He's also got some worms in that Kong toy that he keeps pushing around with his nose there. Aww. So these are just fun things for him to investigate and work a little bit he prefers to work for his food and as you can see he's a very busy guy yeah he's having a good old time so it's good to see him it's good to see you as well people can get tickets right at zoo.org for for uh, wild bites Yes, zoo.org slash wild bites. Uh, I can't guarantee we'll be serving mealworms, which are Harry's favorite <laughs> foods. But like I said, there will be so many different um, tasty bites there, even from local places like Communion, Mamoon, mm. even the restaurant How to Cook a Wolf. Oh, so I had good. to make sure there were no wolves I around know. when I said that, but <laughs> <laughs> it'll be a great time. <laughs> no wolves harmed in the making of this event. So yes, Woodland Park exactly. Zoo, <laughs> animal keeper Susie Sumler, thank you for being with us this morning. Thank you. Absolutely. All right.